How do you look at getting the point? Uh, before going to the point, I, I, I really like our game. Um, I thought we had a really good first period. Um, we had some good chances early in, in, in uh, uh, early in that second period. Two two one ones, one breakaway. I mean, um, if we score there, could have been a, a, a you know a difference maker. But um, five on five, if I, I look at, at at the at the stats, it's it's like twenty five shots for them and twenty four twenty three for us. So that tell, that tells me a lot. I mean, I feel like you know, five on five, we we had a good night. We played well. Unfortunately, they scored two power play goal. It's it, listen, it's the Stanley Cup. I mean, finalists we played against. I mean, it's a good hockey team. I mean, a lot of depth, very good defense. I mean, um, so it was a nice challenge for our group overall. I mean, if if we could have just score here and there, it would have been you know different, but. Uh, I love I love the progression that, of our team. I mean, I I really do. Um, I like the fact that that tonight it looked like a team that play a playoff hockey game, and that's what I like. I mean, uh, would I I don't like those offensive zone penalties. We need to get rid of those. But but other than this. I mean, I think when our guys going to start to understand we can't take penalties in the O zone, then we'll be fine. I mean, but, but hey, listen, we were a long way, and I think we're getting closer to where we want to be. Is that what you want your team to think of now over the break about some of these turnovers and, and penalties that if you can, Man, if you can clean some, them up? Yeah. I mean, we had a good talk this morning about the turnovers, and I think it, it worked well because um, I think it finished – 10-9 uh, turnovers tonight. Huge improvement, you know. Um, so, so I think it's we're we're getting, and I think we understood. But there's yeah, there's there's always something you want to work at. But I mean, when I look at the big picture, I feel like we played a good game. We played against a very good hockey club. I mean, since I've been here, I mean. It was a pretty nice welcome. I mean, we played Dallas as one of the premier team on the other side. We played Vegas that won the Stanley Cup last year. And then we played tonight the, the Stanley Cup finalists in Florida. So <laughs> pretty good. But that's what you want. You want to be measured against top teams and you want to see if what you're doing works. And quite honestly, I mean, I'm, I'm, I like... Uh, I know what we're doing works, and I hope that our player feels the same. I know we're, we're, we wanted that game, but I mean, it, it was it was. I believe that if we continue to play that way, good things will happen. Hey, listen, I mean, I was very pleased with our our young defense. I mean, we're missing key pieces on the defense, and I thought the guys that step in they did a good job. So, so I'm very happy about our uh, about overall about our game. I know it's. It's not the result we want. We want to win every game, let's be honest. But, but at the same time, I mean, it was a good effort by the guys and, and, and the focus was there. And we, I thought it was a hard-fought game. That's how I see it. Patrick, on the Panthers game winner in overtime, was there maybe any confusion when Stolarz played the puck quick to kind of lead to that rush? He just made a great play. You know, okay, I mean, we could have made a little bit of a better change. But listen, it's their D that jump in the, into the rush. Uh, could we have played a one-on-two a little bit different? Yeah, we could have. Rodriguez was the right shot. I mean, this and that. But hey, we had our chances before. That's all I see it. Patrick, just what did you see on, uh, on the penalty kill tonight? I thought we did okay. I mean, um, yeah, we gave a little too many shots, I mean, in, 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 to them, but they're a good power play. I mean, this is a very good power play. So I thought on the first goal, I mean, we were very unlucky. I mean, we could have better stick. I mean, I should not say unlucky. We, we should have had better stick, better position, but it was kind of a broken play, one behind the net, boom, inside, in front, and then winning. The, the second goal was a tip in front of the net by Kachuk, um, trickle between the legs of Varley. So we could have maybe put a little quicker pressure on Barkov, but I mean, 
I, I thought our PK did, 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 a, did a good job. Was it perfect? No. Um, would I like to, to see us be 100% in PK? Yes, because we would have won the game one nothing. And just for you, I mean, how, how, how valuable will this coming week be to, I guess, you know, zoom out and I, I, yeah. I, I assume it's been a week now a little yeah. more than a week but yeah. a week ago we were we were seeing we were talking on the phone yeah I think it'd be it's I mean I'm fresh I mean I, I I'd be happy to play tomorrow or the next day and on but I mean I think it's 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 nice to have the break for the players uh, for everyone and the staff and, and, and you know um, and, and be ready when we come back and play Toronto. But um, I'm going to use this, this, this time to be on, uh, on Long Island and enjoy it and, and learn more about it and, and, and find myself a place to stay. So that's going to be more fun for me than staying at the hotel. I have no problem being at the hotel, but I can't wait to have a place to be and, and enjoy myself. But... All I'm saying is thank you to everyone because the, the fans have been so nice to me and, and, and uh, very supportive, and, and I appreciate everything. And even you guys, thank you for, for, for what you've been doing for, for me and for this organization. Yeah, Patrick, obviously Varley played a, a really strong game. Yeah. Why, why was it important to you to go back to him for a second straight game, you know, given this long break, so now Ilya's not playing for a long Ilya's time? Ilya been, has been like... You know, been playing so many games. Yeah. I thought I thought that was good for him to rest a bit and and and, and give Varley a chance to fit. So so what I love about it, both goalies going to be ready when we come back for Toronto's game, and then to 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 go down that stretch, it's, it's going to be an important one. It's very close in the standing, so we're going to need both goaltenders. We're going to need everybody's playing good. But 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 we all understand there's a push that has to be made at some point. And also, we talked before the game about Wallstrom. Um, you sat him for a little bit in the second period. He comes out, he wins that face-off. Just overall, what do you think? Excuse of, me, I didn't hear the beginning of the question. Uh, uh, Wallstrom. We talked about Wallstrom. Yeah. Before. You know, you sat him a little bit in the second period, it seemed, but he comes out, he wins that face-off, yeah. right? Steps in for Pajot. He played a very good game. I mean, it's it's... And that's what I said to him this morning when I met with him. I mean, I asked him if he was comfortable. I told you that obviously, but um, it's also me learning him and, and trusting him. I mean, uh, it's playoff hockey for our team. So, I mean, sometimes as a coach, you just, just want to see a little more and this and that, but I thought he did a very good job. I thought he played a pretty good game. I mean, I was... It's never easy when you haven't played in, in a long period of time, but I thought he responded pretty well. What did you think about your team's net front presence tonight? Um, I would have loved to see us generating more offense. That's no doubt about it. Uh, I thought we could have used they, – they did a good job, and that's what I explained to our guys after the first they, – they were taking the back of the net away from us, so we could not play you know, behind their net. We needed to use either the pocket or going low to high. I don't think we played, you know, we were as good as we did, let's say, against Vegas and Montreal uh, in that regard. We could have been a little bit better, but they did a good job, you know, closing the wall. I mean, it was, you know, sometimes maybe our guys were a little nervous to bring that puck up, but, hey, these are, these are adjustments that more we're going to practice. I think they're going to feel it, and, and, and it'll be easier uh, along the way. Two big goals for Paul Mary over these last two games. What have you seen from him so far since you've taken over? I'm very happy with him. He's a he's a he's a great vet. I mean, he's he's been he's been a force for us. I mean, he's he's been a very good player, and um, you know, in front of them on the power play, he's doing a good job. And you're right. I mean, he benefited from those six on five. Uh, it was a power play goal against Montreal on the on the back on the side of the net, and this one was a nice one timer, but. My God, what a pass by Noah on this one. Really going across like this, I mean, that was pretty.